So now coming to types of CNC machines that we have presently, we've got milling machines in which we do cutting work and drilling work where the piece is stable in one location, one part and work is done. It can be finishing the edges of the part, it can be flattening the surface of the part, it can be putting drill holes on the part using drills. Then we've got lath CNC machines. Lath machines rotate the part vertically or horizontally and then they shape the part. So it can be creating a bore, it can be having a perfect radius, it can be having the perfect diameter, it can be having the perfect shape for something to fit into something, n number of applications. Then we've got the most important critical, these are laser and plasma cutters. So we've got a huge sheet of metal which needs to be cut into different shapes for a box to be made or for some enclosure to be made. So we just create a 2D file of what needs to be cut and then we put the program in G code M4 on the machine and we place the sheet and hit the button. Within seconds, that whole part can be cut from laser in seconds and be ready. And the best part is it is all accurate. So you can make 1000, 10,000 new parts and they'll all fit together. Then we have something called as routers. So these routers, they are made to mold a part Let's say we've got a wooden block and we would like to mold it into a 3D shape. Let's say we want to do some carving work. It can be used for that. It can be used for numerous applications like carving into wood, drilling it to wood and so and so on. And then grinding machines. These machines have revolutionized the manufacturing industry because grinding machines are the main machines which give the perfect finish that is required for engines, for bearings, to have the smoothness so that there is least amount of friction between two components. And these are the ones that have helped us save on costly maintenance and costly breakdowns. So this is on the types of CNC machines. There are a lot more types of machines than we've got SPM machines, but we'll talk about those in the next video some other day.